and welcome back to the channel on this video I want to talk about rad power bikes as I'm riding the rad rover right now I'm riding the rad rover 4 and the reason why I want to talk about rad power bikes is because they are introducing four new bikes the rad wagon 5 the rad expand 5 and a new model called the Radster. There's going to be a Radster Road and a Radster Trail. So I'm going to kind of zero in on the Radster Road a little bit because that's the one I would choose. So the Radster Road, uh, first of all, they are going to be making two different versions of the bike, which I really like this, where they're making the regular size and then the large size frame. So the regular size Radster is going to accommodate, and this is true for both the Radster Road and the Trail. They're doing this for both bikes. But anyway, the regular bike Radster is going to accommodate Riders that are between four foot eleven and five foot eight, so shorter or smaller in stature uh, riders, and then the large frame or bike roadster is going to accommodate five foot seven to six foot four, and I really like this because we have countless people saying both ways, right? Whether you're tall or short, that I wish there was more bikes that could accommodate me and my size, whichever that may be. So, I've had several people saying that these bikes are too big. And then I've also had people saying, you know, that they're too small, they want them for a larger riders. So I like the fact that they're doing this with their bikes. And the other thing that I like is that they're now adding class three so you're gonna now be able to ride up to 28 miles per hour on pedal assist it's gonna be a 750 watt uh, 48 volt motor 15 amp hour battery hydraulic brakes I believe it is going to come with a rear rack and let me just get by this intersection here. So the bike is also going to come with something else that's really cool, 100 newton meters of torque. So if you have any issues with hill climbing where you are, I think you're going to have uh, a lot less issues with the, uh, the Radster and 100 newton meters of torque. That's, that's really good. I'm glad they're doing that. It will come with a 2 amp charger, 48 volt. It does come with full lights, including headlight, taillight, brake light, and turn signals, which, which is another feature that I really like. I wish um, all bikes came with the turn signals. can I tell you about the bike it has a weight capacity of 320 pounds the bike weighs 74.5 pounds the tire size so these tires are a lot more narrow they're 
they're 29 inch so they're huge tires uh, as far as uh, circumference but 2.2 uh, inches in uh, width so they are uh, big narrow tires for sure So it does have full fenders I should tell you, front and rear. It will have a half twist throttle. The range is supposed to be, I think they're saying up to 65 miles. And it's gonna have five levels of pedal assist. It's gonna be eight gears. And I will leave a link in the descriptions if you want to in the description if you want to go and check it out. The retail price is going to be, or at least the price, the pre-order price. I guess this is retail. It didn't say sale or anything. I don't know if it's going to go up higher after or not, but $19.99 is the price. So. That's the Radster Road or Trail bike. And you know, you had to wonder if something was up with Rad power bikes because they've been knocking their prices down. And I just kind of had a feeling that there was a new model coming out. So, so check it out. The Radster Road or Trail. And like I say, I will leave a link in the description. that's going to do it for this video if you like the video go ahead and hit the like button and if you'd like to subscribe to the channel just hit that subscribe button and thank you very much for doing that and if you want to be notified as to when the next video comes up on the channel just hit that notification bell and you'll be notified and if you want to leave a comment on this or any other video, just go ahead and leave that in the comments below. Once again, thank you for joining me on this video. And until next time, keep your wheels on the road. See you next time.